Hey guys, it's Rob Sipek with Paperless Student. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys different ways of organizing your notes for university or for college. <music> If you're new to my channel welcome don't forget to subscribe if you're looking for solutions to go paperless with your studies or your business and if you already subscribed make sure you turn on your notifications so you know when i release a new video you guys already know i'm a big fan of notability so obviously we will be organizing notes in notability but this approach will work in good notes it will also work in notes plus and upad most note taking applications it won't work with not always though because you can't import anything into not always i organize my notes according to years so i have third year fourth and fifth year and now to organize your notes in the most effective way i suggested using a filing system that i spoke of a few weeks ago if you haven't watched that video make sure you check it out i will put a link in the description down below for this video i'm going to be using a couple of indexed notebooks the first one i'm going to be talking to you guys about is from sean's digital design i will put a link to his it's a store in the description down below i recently started using these index notebooks they're really great for organizing your notes so I keep them under paper templates because this is where I have all the different paper templates that are not available in notability but that I prefer using sometimes for different things this indexed notebook comes with six sections so the type of index notebook that I use depends on the subject how I approach the subject when I'm studying or how the subject is organized according to our syllabus for this pink version I'm going to be using it for internal medicine and and internal medicine comes with different sections it is cardiovascular respiratory it has git nephrology urology and neurology so each section is going to represent a section of internal medicine that i will be covering for that semester every time i do a topic i'll come and edit in the topic section down below And another way I will be organizing my notes will be using another indexed notebook from Simply Digital Design. For this one, I have my sections for each subject. So I'll be using this massive indexed file for one subject. Under that subject, I'll have my study notes, I'll have my class notes, I'll have revision notes, I'll have diagrams and references. So for each topic, I'll have class notes, I'll have lecture notes, I'll have revision questions, I'll have references, and I'll have study notes like that. I can quickly compare them switching from all the sections to make sure that I have covered everything that I need to know. For, you know, surgery, for example, if I have fractures, I'll have fractures in study notes, I'll have fractures in class notes, I'll have fractures in my lecture notes, and I'll collect diagrams for fractures and keep all the references for fractures. If you don't like the idea of having everything on one index notebook then you probably prefer the next option if you love comparing notes side by side then this will probably work better for you so you will have smaller index notebooks and for each subject you'll need about five of them so you have an index notebook for your lecture notes another one for your study notes another one for your class notes another one for your references like that so that you'll be able to compare them side by side in notability using the split view but for this setup you'll need an external source for your text like you'll probably need um, a laptop to study from and other resources if you want to use the split view for notability this is an option that will work for you
note you will need the index notebook to avoid having a mess that i currently have in my notes if you don't understand what the system is exactly and how it works i've done a lot of videos on this so make sure you check that out after this video i'm still currently organizing my notes and let me know if you guys want me to record that for you so you guys see how i am organizing my notes in notability because i will have all of this done by the end of this holiday so that my notes are a little bit more organized so i just thought that this video will help those of you guys that are starting to go paperless it's not a good idea for you to start writing your notes as individual topics and individual notes because after some time you will have hundreds and hundreds of notes while you can search through your notes it's better for you to just have your notes organized because it's less work it's cleaner i am big on minimalistic anything it's better for you to have all your notes in one document than for you to have them in multiple documents and this setup works great if you have a macbook because you can have notability on your macbook which i don't have or if you have another ipad which is something i've had for a long time now but not anymore so i'll have to work around that and see what my approach for this next semester is going to be until I get the next iPad Pro. Make sure that you check out Sean's Digital Design or the Simply Digital Design and grab yourself an index notebook that meets your needs. They have quite a variety to choose from so chances are you'll find something that you need and something that you want. I hope you guys like this video. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Let me know what topics you guys would like me to cover to help you get started with your new semester and thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys in the next video. Oh,